In today's video, I am going to show you five amazing text effects in CapCut. So create a new project and add a black background to the timeline. So head to stock materials, then add a black background to the timeline. So as you can see the black background is 5 seconds long, but if you want to make it a bit longer, click on the freeze button to create a 3 seconds frame, that you can extend to any duration you want. So now it's time to add some text, so go to text and add a default text to the timeline. Then extend your text to match the duration of the black background. Now go to the text area and type what you want, so I will just type auto. So now you can change the font to any font you want, and also resize it a bit. So now change the color of the text to green so we can remove it using the chroma key later in the video. So now select both your text and the black background and create a compound clip. So now import your footage to the media panel, and I will be using this car video for this tutorial. Now add your footage to the timeline, then place your text on top on it, and trim your videos to have the same duration. So now we have to remove the green color, so go to remove background under videos, then select chroma key. Then use the color picker to select the green color to remove it, so you can play around with the intercity to remove the rest of the colors. Now we will make a duplicate of our main footage and place it on top of the text. Then remove the background, so go to remove background, then select custom removal. Now draw over the object and cap cut it. I will automatically make the selection for you. So if you are satisfied with the selection, then wait for a while for it to be processed. Then click on apply, so as you can see our text effect is created but you can add animations to make it a lot nicer. So select your text, then go to animation and you can use any animation you want. But I am going to use fade in for this tutorial and increase the duration a bit. So this is how to create this 3D text effect in CapCut. So let's move to the next tutorial. So I will be using this video for the tutorial, but first we need to create your text first. So go to stock material and import a white background to the timeline. Now go to text and add a default text to the timeline, then extend your text to match the white background. So go to the text area and type anything you want, so I will type camera. So you can make all the necessary editing like, adding animation and even sound effect. So for this tutorial I will add an animation to it. So I have added some animation and also sound effect to my text. So highlight all the clips and create a compound clip. Then add your footage to the timeline. Then place the text you create on top, and I will trim my video because it's too long. So now move your playhead to where the animation ends and make a split there. So just press both Ctrl and V to make the split. And when done make a duplicate of the rest of the footage and place it just right on top. So now we are going to create our split animation, so we will do it one after the other. So I will hide my first track so I can really see what's going on. So select the footage and go to mask, then select horizontal mask, then go to basic and add your first keyframe under transform. Then move the playhead to where you want the animation to end, then drag your footage out of frame. And we are done with the first part, so let's move to the second one. So I will just click on this icon to show my layer. So select that footage, then go to mask, and select horizontal mask. So for this one, we are going to rotate it 180 degrees. Then go to basics and add a keyframe under transform. Then move the playhead to where you want your animation to end, then move your clip out of frame. So if you want your animation to be uniform, you can use the first clip as a reference to know the exact place the keyframe is. So as you can see we have created the text split intro, but it's left with one thing, and is removing the black text, so let's get into it. So move the playhead to where you made the split, then select one of the clips, so I will select the first one. Now go to remove background, scroll down and select chroma key, then use the color picker to select the black to remove it. Now play around with the intensity until all the black color is removed completely. So now let's do same for the other clip. So this is how to create a text split intro and cap cut, so let's move to the next tutorial. So I have already imported my typography footage and the footage I will be using for this tutorial. So first go to stock material, and import a black background. Then import your footage to the timeline. 
Then place it on top of the black background. Then trim it to match the black footage. So now go to remove background. Then select auto removal to remove the background. So wait for a while for the background to be removed. So when your background is removed, add the typography clip to the timeline. Then trim it to match your footage. Now go to basic and scroll down to blend. Click on the drop down menu, then select multiply. Now let's add some adjustment to our footage. So go to adjustment. Then play around with it till you get what you want. And if you want mine as a reference, I will display it on the screen. So try this amazing typography effect in CapCut. And if you have any question, let me know in the comment section. So I will use this YouTube logo, and you can use anything you want to us. Then resize it a bit. So now we have to create the animation. So I want the logo to move to the left, then move to the right. So go to basic and add your first keyframe. Then move the playhead a bit forward and move the logo to the left. Then move another couple of frame and move the logo to the right, and CapCut automatically add a keyframe for you. So go to text and add a default text to the timeline. Then type anything you want, then make all the editing you want, like changing font, color and resize it. Now move the playhead to where the logo start moving from the left to the right. Then select your text, then extend it to match the other footages, then trim that part of, and create a compound clip, so right click on the text and select create compound clip. And this will help as editing it like an actual video. So place your text below the YouTube logo so the text will move behind the logo. Now place the playhead at the start of the text, then go to mask and select horizontal mask. Then rotate it and move it to the left till the text is not visible. Then add your first keyframe. So now as you move the playhead forward, then you adjust your mask, so you repeat to step till all the text is visible. So this is how you can create this text reveal in CapCut. So I will be using this video, so I will add it to the timeline. Now create a duplicate and place it on top of the actual footage. Then remove the background of the duplicated clip. So go to remove background and select auto removal. Then wait for a while for the background to be removed. So now go to text and add a default text to the timeline. Extend your text to match the duration of the footages on the timeline. Then go to the text area and type anything you want. Then change the font and even the color, but I will maintain the white. Then make a duplicate of your text. Then place on of the text in between the footages. Then select the text, then scroll down to stroke, then add stroke to it. And you can use any color you want. Then decrease the thickness a bit. Now change the color of your text to green, so we can use the chroma key to remove it later. Now create a compound clip, so right click then select create compound clip. Then go to remove background, select chroma key then use the color picker to select the green to remove it. And you can play around with the intensity to remove any green color in the text. So now as you can see our outline text has been created, and you can add animations to the text, or even create animation. So these are 5 amazing text effects you can try in CapCut. See you in the next video.